After that, we always felt separated. You two can never undo that rift. Never unmake that harm. No. But we can still reach each other. Impossible. This is your past. Then I have to step outside the past and view it. Compassionately. My mind. My rules. Now, let's bridge this divide. Re-evaluate my beliefs. I originally believed he didn't value my opinion. Now though, I'm seeing he values it a lot. I was so fixated on who was right, as if it could only be one of us. <sighs> Try and see his point of view, even if I don't agree with it. Try and understand how he feels. No matter what, we're both always doing our best. That's enough and all anyone can ask for. You've constructed... A bridge of empathy. A cute trick for us humans, if we do the work. Sis? Octavio, I... What I said before, it wasn't true. But I think I finally understand. All you've wanted from me was... Reframing your regrets. Empathy for the past. Very curious. It's my choice to make. I trust you. I didn't respect you enough to let you make your own decision. And it was me who was scared. By holding on, I was holding you back. You've seen how far I've come? You really can succeed on your own. I'm so proud of you. And I'm so sorry. You may be fixed here. Out there, you're still broken. Yes. I suppose I am. Wait. I understand now. Why I'm trapped here. Yes. Malfunction. Oh. What the? What an interesting turn of events. Your rage has reached such critical levels that Sponsorbot's only recourse is to turn into a killing machine and murder you. Sponsorbot knows you better than anyone. It can anticipate your every move. Might I suggest a new combat style? Perhaps something turn-based. This is where your story was always headed, Francine! Oh, crap! You may have defeated those guards, but you cannot defeat your own anger! Oh, yeah! It's all coming down to the trunk now! I've had just about enough of you! Then prove it! Unless you're too angry, of course. Enough talk! Let's get rowdy! Inevitably, your temper will be the end of you. I'm just cutting to the chase! He'll do it too!
I do my best work when I'm pissed. I'm supposed to apologize for that? a better way of dealing with this. It can't just come down to never be angry or get consumed by it. That's some bulwark. Shut up! It's all or nothing! Stop looking for options! I'm sick of being judged. And I'm sick of being angry. And I'm sick of you! can manage my emotions. They don't control me. And right now, I'm managing them to whoop your ass! Woo! That ain't how it works! You gotta let your anger consume you! Burn in the fires of fury! I want you to know I'm not angry. Just disappointed. Can't kill me. Famous last words. Yo, listen up! This is a hostage situation. No one move. No one even think about moving. Um, Rock? Is he just holding you to his head? Just shoot him! Don't you think I would have done that already? He can't. And neither can you. Or Susan Goldwell will incinerate all of you. She does that, right? Oh, yeah! So, uh, no one move, or I sh shoot me with this Brock. You think he's bluffing? I don't know. I was about to take lunch. I mean, what's the point in going on anyway? I'm not a VIP! I was never on Forge's super successful Dirty 30! Maybe I should just end it all! No! Wait! You have so much to live for! Yeah? Like what? It's a trap! Don't answer that! Okay. Okay. What are your demands? My demands? Oh, yeah! My demands. I've been thinking about so many demands. Tell me where Anu is! Uh, the doctor from the tea talks Oh! She's in a secret restricted area! Which secret restricted area? Uh, we don't know. It's, it's a secret. Oh. The logic's pretty solid. All right. Well, my demands are met. I'm getting the hell out of here. Hold it! Why don't you turn around and put the gun on the ground? Or I'll blow my brains all over this hallway! You're not the only one who can play hostage. You think I won't? You think I won't? Do you think we won't? Just shoot me! I hate 
my feelings. So that one guy's head, right? The hell? Well, if it isn't Bivington Bradwick. Mr. VIP himself. Or was it VVIP? I lost track after you put me in a cage! Listen, I know things got weird at that party. Between you and me, Susan really knows how to kill a vibe, you know? <laughs> and me! She killed me! Like a bunch of times! At the tea talk, I saw! I was like, what? What? <laughs> you know? Man! I mean, Susan hired me to trap you, but that was just so not namaste. So I totally get that you're feeling a little... Like, so many feelings, but mainly feeling a little... Pissed? Sure. Look, you've got the wrong impression of me. I first thought you were a fame-thirsty idiot. But look at everything you've done here. That's brains. Literally, brains. You don't know who I am. Where I've been, the things I've seen. I was in prison for 30 minutes. Ugh. That's amazing. Like, that's the kind of experience that can really impress Silver Spoon investment brats. Like you? Oh. Not unlike me. <sighs> Look, you've been a pathetic nobody hustler for your whole life. You're so low on the ladder, Susan Coldwell's only keeping you alive as leverage. She doesn't care about your potential. But I do. Put down the talking gun and let me make you a superstar, Octavio. Let me make you a real VIP. Nah, I'm good. You hate me more than Bivington, right? Right? Uh, I'm checking this wall directory, but every room looks the same. Oh yeah, tell me about it. I get lost here all the time. Wait a minute! We're not on the same side! Don't move! Fran! Ah. Good. You are alive. Want some tea? Uh... Sure. Splendid brew some tea. Uh, there isn't any tea. Pity. Shall we bone? What? 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 Where's Anu? After your horrendous torture, Susan mentioned taking your sister to a lab. Is that where you're going? I was going... Uh, uh, you know, I don't know where I was going. I sort of picked up this gun and walked around. Well, let's just kick down every door until we find her. Door number 108. Where's my sister? Uh, this is Susan's office. Hot. Diggity donuts. Yep. improve your mood a little well, spread out there's got to be something in here that'll tell us where to find on it sure thing but before we do that you're special to me I know so spitch thanks I'm giving you an air hug <laughs> I'm giving you one back Guns can form it, I would! Lower your feelings, 
are disgusting! Dumbass! Louis, guard the door while we look around. Affirmative. I'll stay here and summon the guards with my mind. You can do that? No, but I can try. I can try! Who wants to give me an oil bath? <sighs> I'm gonna crumble you like feta. Wow! This office is amazing! This is your first time in Susan's office? Oh, no, I mean, it's amazing how this office never changes. Because I spent so much time in here. <laughs> because I'm such close personal friends with Susan Caldwell. We, uh, we, we have a time chair together. It's, 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 it's really exclusive. Um, uh, we go together like peanut butter and guns. Chunky peanut butter and bullets. Guns. Yeah. Ooh, I feel like I'm sweating bullets in here. A vault lander? Who would leave a vault lander lying on me? You fell right into my perfectly laid trap. No, I didn't. You fell from an air duct. Did I? Yes. Well, now you have to hang out with me. Because of the trap, that's the rule. Hey! I know that weirdo. He's obsessed with Vaultlanders. And we're playing. And if I win, you have to live in the air duct and breathe asbestos. You've been breathing asbestos? Let's play! Select your Vaultlander. Claptrap. Claptrap versus Handsome Jack. Vaultlanders! Fight! Super 
Most impressive. You have learned all I can teach you. You didn't teach me anything. And now, I shall disappear into the unknown. What are you talking about? <coughs> are you trying to crawl in the air duct? You can't see. It's too smoky. <sighs> Get a load of big suits. What an ugly mug. Would be a real shame if someone broke her face. A real shame. My finger slipped. Friend! Did I do that? Any ideas on how we can find Anu? Yeah. Shh. Computer! Find Anu. Find Anu. That's all I got. Base directory. Where's Anu? The rash goes. It's a decoy computer. <laughs> no, no, no. No button tells me what to do. Is this Susan's Equidex? The Supreme Deluxe Model! Ultra thin titanium bezel, 12 cameras, long lasting iridium battery. This isn't even in stores yet! Ock. Let me just try one app. Ooh, TDR Friend Maker. I wonder what it does. Oh, uh, we don't have time for you to make friends. Let me at least try one button. If I can find a terminal, I can probably track Anu through the surveillance system with this baby. The bigger the statue, the bigger the butt! Louis, can you plug yourself into a terminal here? 
Why would I do that? So you can access the mainframe and find Anu? Oh, so you think just because I'm a robot, I can plug myself into a terminal? We're both machines. Machines love plugging themselves into machines. That's... I, I didn't mean... A little reductive, don't you think? It's these ignorant, anti-mechanistic attitudes that hurt robots everywhere. I'm sorry. I never meant to offend you. It's okay. I, these confrontations just tend to drain my battery. I'm going to go plug myself into the first socket I see. Ah! to give me an oil bath. He's doing stand-up sets at every comedy club in Promethea? The Ha Ha House? Captain Korn's Chuckle Hut? Promethea Penitentiary? Wow! Wait, what's this? He's got a sitcom green lip? Where's my bounty? Put in the ass in ass assassination. From hearing this fall on PBC, I'm so gonna watch that. Let's see where we can dig up an old rock. He's writing a book? There's my memoir. Eat, pray, gun. One sentient firearm's journey through life, love, and spiritual fulfillment. And how he became better for it. And how he shot a lot of stuff along the way. That's a really long title. I'm looking for constructive notes. Okay. Let's see what we got on your background, Fran. Uh, most likely to burst the blood vessel. Impressive. True. Uh, most likely to pork the principal. Less impressive. But true. Um, I think we're done. I forgot. Humans are slow. Ooh, I can scrub the surveillance system and find Anu. <coughs> Password protected? Of course. Just guess it! That never works. She likes money. Try money. That's stupid. Try money. <sighs> it didn't work. Needs a number. Try money one. <sighs> Forget it. Try millions of money. Big box. Bitch of box of bags of moolah. Dough. Lots of dough. Cashola, give me mula. Seven, seven, seven. I don't know why, just like seven. All right, let me just hack into the terminal with Susan's fancy new Echodex. No, wait, my fancy new Echodex. So sleek, so powerful, so expensive. The ultimate symbol of a true VIP. Just holding it, I feel like a boss. <laughs> Such a boss. Such a boss. I'm a boss. I'm forgetting myself. I need to hack this thing. Curse you, sexy Equinox. Alright, now with Susan's firewall, this could take... I'm in! <laughs> Lightning fast! Never leave me, fancy Equinox. Never. What are you doing? <sighs> it's mine! You can't tear us apart! It's not my type. 
We're here for the terminal. Right, the terminal. Looks like they're keeping Anu in a lab. Here, Sector Zeta. That's an Omega. That's what I said. Are we ready to rescue Anu and get the fudge out of here? It's hero time. You said I'm fixed here, but I'm not. And I can't be who I want to be out there until I make peace with who I really am and what I've done. And I'm starting with you. You told everyone on Promethea you took a job at Atlas so you could change the world. I wanted to be seen changing the world. I never pondered what that actually meant. You can adapt, Anu. Grow. I always saw that. Which is why I think I hired you. Or why I think you think you hired me. Right. Exactly. The truth is, I took the job because I was desperate for approval and acceptance. My acceptance? Yes. In a way, I admired you. You're a hero, an entrepreneur. Keep going. The people you deem intelligent? Did you really need me to tell you you're intelligent? No. I always knew that. I just didn't trust it. Then, do you need me? A manifestation of your boss to tell you to trust yourself? No. I could do that on my own. You're seeing yourself more clearly now. wall is a construct of my own mind. It's just a mental barrier. <sighs> what? I face walked through it! Oh, oh, face walk! Oh, oh, face walk! Oh, you know who else face walks? Lilith the Siren. Lilith face walks. I face walk. Transitive property. My guts undefiled by a rupturous load. You don't have to talk like that here. Say what you mean. You killed me. It was self-defense. It was murder. I never intended. Intention? The violence remains. I thought darkness only lurked in other people. Bad people. But it's also within me. You're proof of that. You reflect. Give your sin meaning. That is courage. I was worried about you. Idiot! She's healing from 
faster than we can move. I don't usually like the corporate types, but there's just something about it. Want to get tacos? Okay. Can't face walk this. I always dreamed of being a siren, and this is a lucid dream space. Maybe I can also... <laughs> Face grasp! <gasps> You're no better than that Susan Coldwell, if you ask me. You're both playing with, with power you don't understand. Stealing corpses as research for her secret project. You trapped me in a coffin. Clearly we had some trust issues. Unless specified, the dead don't belong to you, or me, or science. On a planet surrounded by death, the dead deserve respect. If we don't, how could we ever respect life? Now you're getting it! Okay, uh, no platforms, nothing to grab. I guess the only thing I could possibly do is... <gasps> oh, okay, Anu, you got this. In here, you're a siren. In here, you can... stopping the pain all around you. True. But that makes us capable of something else. What's that? Compassion. Reflection and ultimately, change. with this device as the solution. So obsessed with solving the universe's pain, I didn't even see the pain right in front of me.
watch over this woman. She, or what's inside her, is the most valuable object in the universe right now. Far more valuable than you. Do I make myself clear? Clear. Mm -hmm. I am going to the bridge to determine why in the seven hells somebody prematurely launched our ship back into space! How you pistol whip? Really wish you didn't demonstrate with me. I knew. Free, I'm free, free at last. Yippee skippy ki yay, mother truckers. Leave, lady, alone. Scanning. You are so lucky. I don't know your face or name. I don't need a name to knock this one's head off. You want a jet? Whoa, 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 whoa! We can both come out of this ahead. There's gotta be something you want, right? Lady! My sister? Pick something else. Sister? Yeah, yeah. You jackasses weren't holding me prisoner because I'm important. You just knew Anu wouldn't want anything to happen to her brother. Laugh it up! Octavia doesn't matter! Ha ha ha! So funny! Uh, something you want to talk about, Ock? Then you can care about her from back there, friendo. My sister's gotten the crap kicked out of her enough. She doesn't need anything else. Brother? Friend? Friend? It would appear this TDR guard is previously acquainted with Anu. And may also be a psycho. Not psycho anymore! TDR guard now! Why would a psycho bandit sign up to be a corporate foot soldier? Free gym membership! Great! Awesome! Let's get her out of here! Great! Awesome! Came here to rescue her also! Thought you were trying to kill her! Glad we clear up comical misunderstanding! Yeah, not that comical. It was a little bit comical. Anu! <sighs> you can help me up now. Yeah. <sighs> Oh, oh, headache. <clears throat> uh, I know this isn't a great time, but I sort of shot myself in the leg. You sort of shot yourself in the leg? I shot myself in the leg, all right? Why did you shoot yourself in? Can you just heal it, please? Give me that zap zap. Thanks, Bunches. Hey, don't judge. Remember that time you shot Louis? I still feel bad about it. Uh, Louis, can you please forgive me for that? Very well. Initializing forgiveness program. You are forgiven. Wow. <laughs> I forgot how much better a non-shot leg feels. How do you two know each other? Long story. Short version! We are friends! Maybe more! Very will they, won't they? I see. Have you two had a uh, mouth to mouth? No. Why? No reason. You were comatose for a while. Is your brain malfunctioning? I had such a cool dream. I was a siren. Now, headache. 
That is not healthy. Anu? Anu, wait. Who are we dealing with? Is it Anu or that shard spirit thing? Huh. Is it me? Is it me? Is it me? <laughs> Stapleface knows this feel. Of course, on me. If I were an all-powerful shard spirit, I wouldn't be as terrified as I am right now. Or is that exactly what an all-powerful shard spirit would say to make us think it was you? Anu, what's your favorite Froger flavor? Oh, <laughs> gosh. Uh, how to choose? The, 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 there's just so many f flavors. So much of Ram staring at me right now. I, um, vanilla, vanilla. It's on you for sure. Is it just me or did it feel like we? Yeah, we're in space. Black starry sky town. Oh, launch. As in launch the building into space, not, <laughs> not the app. What? How was I was supposed to know? Who puts a button like that on their Echo Dex? Okay, okay, that's on me. I'll take the L. But I can fix this. There's definitely an unlaunch button here. And Viola! New idea. We all find escape pods. Immediately. Don't have to tell me twice. I hate space, and I hate this corporate dump. I'm not leaving. <laughs> Hilarious bit. Woman who won't leave. <laughs> so good. Okay, let's go. We can't. Why the hell not? We sure as mother can. You find an escape pod, get in the escape pod and escape. I'm not leaving while the short is still inside me. And to be honest, I'm not sure I can leave while the short is still inside me. Wow, you really are hard up on being this special sparkle princess. This is bigger than me. At this range, Susan can use her shard and her doomsday machine. She'll destroy Promethea. What? No! All my stuff is there! <gasps> Things you own, own you. When you say doomsday machine... A larger, more powerful iteration of our own device that some cool, but not intimidatingly cool scientist kinda, sorta, tricked me into creating for her. A big, giant, humongous, super gun. Super device. Actually, yeah, in this case, it's a gun. Okay. Okay. How do we stop her? In Atlas, we operated our highest level weapons from the ship's bridge. It also controls ship's flight path! Dear training, leave fun fact in staple base brain. Our mission is clear. Storm the bridge. Kill or knock out Susan. And return these shards where they belong. It sounds like the perfect plan. Except the bridge is the most fortified section of the ship, defended by swarms of TDO guards, drones, turrets, exploding toilets, and filthy data ports that lie about their age and don't text you back. I'm just guessing about the last one. Don't worry about getting to bridge. Stapleface has plan. I hate this plan. here. How approach, lady? Did you just call me lady? Direct orders, remember? Direct orders! What orders? Orders from who? Boss Crone! Fast, fast! Take friends to bridge! 
friends! Prisoners! Who are prisoners? <laughs> but also friends. Wait, so they're your prisoners, each other's friends, and you have direct orders to take them to the bridge? Y yes! Okay, move now! Hold her right there! I'm calling this in. Nobody move. We probably should not let them call this in. Now we're definitely calling this in! Emergency lockdown protocols above staple faith and paperage! Well, I'm out of ideas. It'll take sophisticated technology to interface to demagnetize the seal. What about beep boop pep? You know, beep boop pep, your echo decks. You think beep boop pep is a sound for my echo decks? Just use your echo decks! Oh yeah, I can do that. <laughs> I can honestly say, this is not how I saw my week going. You and me both. I suppose it'll be over soon, one way or the other. Hopefully a good way, and not the other. I mean badly. I hope it doesn't end badly. When this is all over, we're gonna celebrate. Yes, we'll do something really fun. Different. Something special. We'll go for Froyo. We'll go for Froyo. That dog again? Now you're just going in and hold their horses while I suss this people out. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't help but turn on Susan's voice disguise. It's a hit and a half. <laughs> Octavio! Yeah, he got him. All peaches. to call friends. She uses it to make and remake friends. Don't you see? What? I'm still hip. I still get technology. I wonder if I can customize the settings and give it a dark theme. Just use your stupid echo dumper. Friend code scanned. me back to the main menu. Okay, I'm bored. Rock and load, baby. Rock, 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 rock. rock out. Rock it out, Sitting by the rock on the bay. The end. Wait, where are you going? I can tell it another way.
bombastic, braggadocious behavior. So you give murder robots a bad name. GG. Well played. Oh, grab, grab, grab. You have a friend in range. Huh? Of course! TD or friend maker! Susan doesn't use the app to call friends. She uses it to make and remake friends. Don't you see? What? I'm still hip. I still get technology. I wonder if I can customize the settings and give it a dark theme. Just use your stupid echo dumper! Friend code scanned. Don't look at my code! I brought an Echodex to a gunfight. Why can't I shoot you? Why can't I shoot you? Your safety is permanently on. I'm a gun that can't shoot? Technically, you're not even a gun. Teteor doesn't register you as a weapon anymore. Maybe don't shoot people. <laughs> Enjoy your life as a paperweight. <laughs>